A brand new RPG inspired by classics like Baldur's Gate takes you to the kingdom of Isil Mirald. A once peaceful and prosperous land, now falling prey to the whims of Zornilsa, the dark goddess of greed and envy. Poisoning the land with chaos and betrayal, inciting conflict and war as her dark game unfolds. Choose to join her ranks and support her wicked cause or oppose her malicious endeavors as a defiant hero. Summon the courage to defy Zornelsa and face the Dark Goddess's fury at every turn, or offer obedience for wealth and power. Whichever path you choose to pursue, boundless adventure awaits. So gather your party and journey into the unknown. Vow to restore the righteous glory to the kingdom of Isil Mirald. Or become Zornilsa's agent of greed and usher the kingdom into an era of chaos, despair, and everlasting darkness. Hey there, my name is David Zakal. I have been active in the software industry for more than 12 years. I've managed several projects and now I finally have the chance to launch my own game, Black Geyser, Careers of Darkness, an isometric, party-based, single-player, real-time with pause RPG with a strong story, tactical combat, complex dialogues and rich characters. Her studio, Grey Potion Technologies, is new to the RPG industry but her team members have worked with several titles in the past, including Witcher 3 Wild Hunt or Assassin's Creed. Black Geyser, Couriers of Darkness, brings back the old traditions of classic style RPGs we all loved, with a number of innovative features. It's a game of diversity, offering you a great amount of detail and freedom in every aspect the old classics did. In this game, you have complete freedom to explore the wilderness and countryside of the kingdom, including forests, caves, fields, villages, carnivals, and outskirts of cities, completing hundreds of quests just to end up at your favorite tavern drinking your favorite ale. You do all of this in an environment that is alive and changing over time, influenced by your decisions. And it's not just a single decision, but all your decisions throughout the game. The game looks for patterns and trends. It really comes down to your playing style, and within your style, there is one thing in Black Geyser that is absolutely crucial, your approach to greed. Greed afflicts the entire kingdom as a curse, an infection that affects every aspect of life and constantly spreads over time. Which means prices and shops go up, NPCs are getting more suspicious, making interactions and dialogues more challenging. Lawful citizens may go mad and try to rob you, and so on and so forth. Your actions are no exception, which means you're able to slow down or speed up the spreading of the curse according to how greedy or generous you are. For example, when looting, accepting rewards, or donating to temples. Keep in mind that situations are not often obvious. For example, if you fail to recognize that a priest is obsessed by greed and you donate to his temple, the result on greed will be completely the opposite as the donation will never reach the poor. To be brief, your approach to greed enables a variety of different playing styles, greatly increasing replayability of the game. Do you want to be a heartless tyrant who seizes every coin from the poorest, or a benevolent ambassador of generosity and righteousness. <laughs> it's only your decision in Black Geyser, Couriers of Darkness. Greed adds an ominous flavor even to apparently peaceful areas, and game songs will capture this special flavor. When you enter a peaceful looking village or carnival, you cannot actually know if everything is alright or something very wrong is awaiting you. Music is a great way to express the special nuances of the game atmosphere. The grid system is certainly not the only unique feature of the game, but it's one of the most challenging for us as developers to do it right. And this is actually one of the reasons we created this Kickstarter. We want to involve you in the process. We need your feedback, your voice before the game is completed. 
The other reason for Kickstarter is that we came to the point when we need either a publisher or a Kickstarter to complete the game. Last year we got several inquiries, even offers from publishers, but such a deal would restrict our creative freedom and lessen our control of the game, restricting our ability to customize the game based on your feedback. So, we need your help to make Black Geyser Careers of Darkness a reality as an independent product and the rightful successor of the old classics we all loved. Thank you for watching. We are Manavoid Entertainment, a small independent studio based in Montreal, Canada. We are currently working on a video game called Epic Manager, where, for the first time ever, you'll be able to create your own adventuring agency. The game is played from the manager's office where there's a huge map of the realm on his desk. As the manager, the player can send his scouts on different missions to gather information or to recruit adventurers, and he can send his adventuring parties in order to accomplish quests that are going to bring him back some gold and augment his agency's reputation. Here's the catch. Every time a party moves on the map, there's a chance that a random event or encounter happens, just like in Dungeons & Dragons. This will bring the player to fight and make choices that will influence his game progression and shape the narrative in many different ways. Also, let's not forget that the player will be competing against other adventuring agencies as well. He'll need to manage his time, his gold, and the training of his adventure as well in order to get the upper hand on his opponents throughout the game. Every year, the managers from all of the agencies meet up and have a tournament where the winner will become the one they call the Epic Manager. He is the protector of the realm for that entire year and gets first dibs on the most lucrative but dangerous jobs. So the player starts off in a small town, doing odd jobs with a handful of adventurers under his employ. But as his fame grows, so does his roster size, his agency, his quest log, his reach across the realm, and consequentially, his chances of becoming the Epic Manager. Once we had the idea of a player acting as an adventuring agent, we decided to create a game that offered a unique mix of features that we just love in epic fantasy games. We wanted random encounters like in Dungeons and Dragons, we wanted a level-based job system like in Final Fantasy Tactics, but we also wanted a management simulation game on an epic scale like Crusader Kings 2. Mixing these features together will create a deep strategic game with an exciting combat system. An emergent narrative will also draw the player in and keep him guessing throughout the entire experience. The Adventure Agent Twist also gives us so many unexplored mechanics and gameplay opportunities to have fun with. Some of these were already seen in popular tycoon or sports games. It's always been about taking some of the mechanics from these great games and twisting them to our own genre, which are fantasy RPGs, and making them correlate with every other feature we really want to put in the game. One of the coolest things about this game is its replay value, because every campaign is going to be different from one to the next. This game is really good at giving the player choices. Which quests do you want to do? How do you deal with random encounters? And there's always three or four options. Uh, which factions do you want to help? Which ones do you want to destroy? All of these choices will influence the dynamic of this living world, and it'll change how the narrative evolves as the game goes on. So we wanted to play this game for the longest time. We tried to find anything close to our concept, like a similar experience or something, but nothing could be found out there. So we decided we're just going to get together and with the great Kickstarter community we're going to make it happen. 
We really believe there's a strong community of players for a game like Epic Manager, and actually, we can't wait for you guys to play it. Kickstarter really lets us have immediate feedback from you, the community of gamers we really, really want to make this game for. With your help, we want to bring in everybody on the creation process. Anything from design, to programming, artwork, and even marketing. Everyone's welcome in sharing this great experience. Kickstarter is the best way to bring this game to life without having to compromise on quality or the integrity of our vision. So far, we've invested our own time and money to work full-time on this project, and we're currently on pace towards the alpha version of Epic Manager. We already have a great design, innovative features, and a very interesting emergent narrative, but we really need your help to bring the overall game to another level. We truly believe Epic Manager will be an awesome game. Your money will help us bring it to its full potential by allowing us to hire some additional artists and to keep working on the project full-time. Thank you very much for watching. We hope you take the time to read the rest of the Kickstarter page. We're going to keep updating it with videos and new content during the month of this Kickstarter campaign. Um, hit us up. Don't be a stranger. Uh, questions, comments on Facebook, Twitter, email, all that stuff, all that jazz. We have it and we're going to answer every single question that's thrown at us. Um, and we hope you enjoyed this video. We hope you enjoyed the project and we really hope that you're going to help us out to make this dream game come true. Thanks guys. Thanks.